goal has always been to learn from small farmers. That's also why we are called Center for Learning on Sustainable Agriculture. To learn from small farmers and see uh, what they are doing in agriculture, how they are innovating, how they are sharing their innovations uh, within and beyond their communities. And what Elia uh, has decided right in the beginning when it started and what still is valid today is let's help these small farmers to amplify uh, their sharing because they are sharing uh, up to a certain level within and beyond their communities but there are so many more others who can benefit uh, from interesting uh, learnings of small-scale farmers in agriculture. There are about 400 million small-scale family farmers and small-scale farmers are not interested in outcompeting each other. It's about living together as communities and living in, uh, in a good balance with the environment, not against but with nature. Uh, it's important that policymakers are made to realize, if they haven't realized yet, that small-scale farmers contribute in a very important measure not just to food production in the world, they produce food which is enough for one third of the world's population. It's not just about producing more calories or more money or uh, more food. It is about bi maintaining biodiversity. It's about p keeping people employed. It's about maintaining landscapes. It's about keeping cultures alive. That's why Ilaya invented this magazine. And the magazine uh, yeah, is in a way a means to help farmers, small-scale farmers, to amplify uh, their voices and their experiences. The Agricultural Network is uh, the, the, the group of organizations working in different parts of the world, all of whom produce a similar magazine to Farming Matters. Uh, from the mid-1990s onwards, uh, in ILAIA we started collaborating with groups, networks, organizations in different parts of the world which then started to establish their own magazines. So the magazine was also an important uh, instrument that we shared, started sharing in the networks. We welcome others to come and share with us in various ways, you can send uh, something to us which you think is interesting and worth sharing, uh, like an article for our magazine. If there are organizations which say, well, we are really interested in joining the global network and we want to set up our own um, regional uh, member network and we want to start publishing a magazine in our own regional language, you are very welcome to contact us. We would like more and more people to write to us so that these experiences can reach others who might benefit from them, who might, get, uh, in, who might feel inspired because of what they're hearing or reading. And at the same time, we invite all interested people to uh, visit our website to take a subscription to the magazine. Because the magazine shows what other people are doing and what the opinions and the experiences of other people, we are always interested in receiving stories. What I hope to achieve, not personally, but as a growing movement for sustainable family farming is that um, family farmers get a better acceptance 